how to access smartphones with broken screen and get all your file and data out of it. And this will be the part three and it's 2025 people are still asking me how do you do that. Okay, so today I'm going to show you a special thing that the OEM, the manufacturers of this smartphone, can put into the phone to make sure that you can use the screen or the display even when it's broken physically. This is called USB display output port function. Some call it alt mode, some call it cast mode. But for your phone to have it and it's USB-C, it must have USB-C 3.0. 0.1 and newer. So let's go in. I'm going to show you how you're going to do this and it's going to be very practical. I'm going to cast some of these devices you're seeing here on the screen uh, using HDMI. Now there are two types of HDMI that you can use. This is USB HDMI, USB-C to HDMI adapter that you can use to connect the smartphone to a HDMI display. Now this is another USB, USB-C to HDMI, but this one has extra ports where you can put a keyboard or mouse to like put in your pattern or your password or pin in case the screen is actually locked. So with these two, we're going to go in and I'm going to show you how to use them. So let's start with iPhone. Now this is the iPhone 16 Pro and it has USB-C. So thank God it has USB-C so I don't have to buy another accessories with lightning port for iPhone and buy another one for Android. So this is iPhone, USB is connected to HDMI on the screen. You can see no signal showing on the TV, but right now I'm going to connect it. So keep an eye on this, connect it. The phone will show you that it has received a cast signal and now it's showing on the screen. So it's very, very interesting that it can do that. Imagine if I play a YouTube video, uh, play this, and make it full screen. Liverpool could be Premier League champions this time next week. So now let's come to Android, and this is Red Magic 10 Pro, the fastest smartphone of 2025. Now, the important thing about this is that it has USB 3.2 Gen 2. So it's one of the fastest USB that you have out there on Android. And let me show you what it can do. I'm going to plug it in. And as I plug it in now, it will automatically, if it has this function, start displaying on the screen. So that is called USB uh, display output function. Now, for some of these Chinese knockoff uh, brand and uh, flagship killers, they put USB 2.0, so they can't even have the option to put in the USB display port function. So before you buy a smartphone, especially on the Android side in 2025 and beyond, make sure that the device is up to USB 3.1 and that the OEM is giving USB display port output function. It's now common in a lot of, you know, top mid range and flagship devices. And with that, if the screen is broken, the physical screen is broken, you can always take in a USB-C to HDMI adapter and then you use it to plug in your phone and it will start displaying here. With that, you can connect a Bluetooth mouse or any other mouse to use it to open your phone, copy your files, get everything you needed. For some of you are asking me, what if the screen is broken and you cannot access it? So let me give you an example. This is a Samsung S8. And mind you, this is a 2018 phone, but in 2018, Samsung introduced that DeX function with USB uh, port display output function. So this phone in 2018 came with USB version 3.1 and that's why it was possible. So now I cannot use just this HDMI to because this is not a touch screen. So if I put it in here, it will just display. How do I put in the pin or pattern or password? Now, so if that's what you're asking, this is the second HDMI that I showed you earlier. Now this is HDMI with USB-A and USB-C uh, to the device. So what we now have to do is we will now plug this to this device and now we'll connect HDMI and also we connect mouse or keyboard and we use it to put in the password and the pin and with that we'll be able to enter the device copy any files send it through turn on the internet turn on bluetooth turn on nearby share quick share send it to anywhere we want to send it and we can even decide to use it like that like a permanent dex and the good thing about this uh, particular adapter is that if i plug in usb-c here it turns on DEX function on the S8. So with a broken screen on this S8, I still use it uh, like a mini computer 
or anything to work and get all the files and anything I want in it. So this is the option you have if your OEM built it in. And I would advise anybody in 2025 and beyond, if you're buying a smartphone, make sure it has USB-C display port output function and make sure that the USB port is up to USB-C version 3. Point one. So that's a whole lot you can do with these adapters. I'm going to put the link in the description. You can use this to connect to your TV and you can even play out any file or you want. So this one is single connector. This one is multiple that allows you to put a HDMI, a mouse or keyboard, any other accessories that can work with your device. So yes, I'll put the link in the description. So do like, share. Let me hear from you in the comment section. Make sure you follow me here for more interesting tech tips. <laughs> Till I see you in the next one. It is peace. Subscribe. I see you.